Welcome back, I'm Jay, we got Steve behind the camera. This is the Heads Up Show where we talk about helmets and face masks and all that good stuff. And today we're building another super custom helmet. This is a 50-50 Eli Manning Giants and Eli Manning Newman High School. Danny, who uh, wears a helmet, he goes to all the Giants games, home and away, all the practices, all the Super Bowls, everything. He has been thinking about and dreaming up this exact helmet design. I don't know, Steve, four years, five years? It's been a long time. It didn't take us that long to put it together, but it's been a while. It, it, it felt like it did. <laughs> this is not an easy one to get all the pieces for. I'm really excited to put this one together. So stay tuned, check it out. This is a really good video. Um, put your feet up, relax a little bit, and just sit back and enjoy. And tell us, leave comments below as you're watching this thing, how you like it, what pieces you like. Super, super custom. We're gonna be going over all those little bits and details as we go through this thing. This is kind of everything that we've got. We've mapped this out, how everything is gonna be going on the helmet. We've got some chrome decals here, our US flag and NFL shield. We've got the numbers, so we're gonna have everything Newman on one side, everything Giants on the other, then the NFL radio decal, we're gonna straddle the line, so to speak. Um, and this is what it's gonna look like, 3D bumpers on the front and then Newman on the back here. And Steve, you actually doubled up the Newman, so or the Newman rear bumper, so you won't be able to see the red Riddell uh, letters through the decal. We're gonna go with Giants Red first, and what's really nice about this is we have a nice line to, to go down. So what you're saying is no excuses if you screw this up. I'm sure I can find an excuse or two, Steve. <laughs> what do you think, Steve? Are we gonna be cutting this stripe? Well, I'll tell you this much. Eli's Giants helmet does not have cut numbers, but it does have a cut stripe. The Newman High School was no speed flex it even existed when he went there, but they did have a stripe. I would say, let's not cut it. Do you like that logic? I like that logic too. And the other piece of that that I would say is, if you don't cut it and we want to change it later, we can always cut it. Yeah. But if we cut it and we want to go back, well, there is no going back. Yeah, you're beat. Look at that paint job too, man. Oh yeah. So. Let's talk about this helmet a little bit. So we started off with a white Riddell Speed size large helmet. And then we set it off to get painted. It's got a great paint job, but this is a gloss white. So this was taped basically all taped off and then painted half Giants Blue. And the other half is a gloss white paint. There's a difference, Steve, between a gloss white painted helmet and just a white painted helmet or impregnated. Impregnated means the color has been put into the material before they molded the helmet. Yeah, so Steve is now literally sitting or standing behind me. Uh-oh. Danny, how's it going, man? Well, Steve, or Danny, we're literally filming right now. Danny, we're live, guy. Oh, shit, my bad. <laughs> <laughs> well, hey, man, it's your helmet, so if you want to say hi to the people, go ahead. What's going on, guys? <laughs> um, so, yeah, it looks real good. It's going to come out perfect. You know what else I was thinking? A, a cool idea, but I mean, I don't know if you have it or not. You see, like, uh, the American flag. Don't have like a American flag like that where it looks like the St. Patty's green one. It's just all green, but it looks like the American flag. We have a um, we have a chrome green. We'll give it a shot, and then what I'll do is I'll include the regular, the red, white, and blue one, and you can swap it if you want. All right, cool. All right, tell you, hey Steve, later, bro. Later, man. <laughs> Thanks, man. Bye. So this is a transfer decal, Steve. This is how it works. Pull the backing off. And this keeps the decal exactly, well, the pieces of the decal anyway, exactly where they're supposed to be. So on this helmet, Steve, we follow this line right here. And this is our horizon line. And this is gonna basically be going perpendicular to it. I would say that's where some people mess helmets up 
because they do it on their table or their desk so it's level, but that's not really how it's supposed to go. And then we start from the center, and we start putting everything down from there. And on this one, because we're putting a flat thing on a round surface, we wanna make sure that all these pieces are just right. So sometimes I like to take a little, the, under, uh, the underlining part of the Y there and kind of put it, lay it down to make sure that it fits just perfect after I peel all this off. <laughs> that is so satisfying. Exactly how it is done in the Giants locker room. Or so we hear. Okay, here we go. Now the Newman side, this is a much bigger decal. It's a bigger end. So you have fun with this one. This one's gonna be a little tricky. I think that's oh, the spot. that's the spot. You know, that's the spot. All right, let's do the back next. So, by, so what we did here, what Steve did, is he doubled up this decal. You can still see the raising a little bit here when you look really close, but I think once, you, once you're once you wearing it, you're not gonna be able to see that from a couple feet away. Oh man, that looks great. And we actually oversized this decal by 10% so it would cover the entire bumper. And it does, I think it's great. Yeah. Eli Newman was number 18. Big Brother's number. On the Giants, obviously, he's number 10, so you're gonna get a zero. Nice. All right. That was Danny's call, it's with the man wants. Sure. And I like putting these chrome decals on the ridge because then you can see the reflection a little bit different. Can you get that? Oh, yeah. In the exact spot Eli wears his radio decal. And over here, I'm going to be built by Green Gridiron. An NY 3D bumper on the front. We're going with the gray and blue on this guy. Sports Star Victory T-Rex. Check this out, Steve. You ready for this? Ready. We've got white bladder cap screws. We've got a white, painted white. So this is a gloss white Sports Star Speed Flex adapter on this side. We've got obviously the white buckles over here. And over here, we've got the Giants Blue and we've got the Giants Blue Sports Star Speed Flex adapter. All right, so here we go. Let's do the face mask now. So on this mask, we have a shock Northern Lights visor. We've got Eli's SF2BDSW face mask. Oh, that's a good click.
Dude, what a really, really cool, weird, interesting build. Yeah, this one is phenomenal. Wow. And it's so nice because it's completely unexpected to have something like this. Are you kidding me? That is nice. You know what? You got to do it. I think Danny would be okay with me putting it on. I got to try this one on. You have to. And we'll close this thing out. Hey, Danny, there you go, man. This thing is great. Thank you so much. We got so much going on with this Elma. It was a labor of love for quite some night quite some time now. So Dan, I really hope you appreciate this one. Can't wait to see it on, I don't know, maybe he'll wear this one to the Super Bowl, Steve. He will wear it to the Super Bowl. <laughs> Somewhere. <laughs> so listen, like, subscribe, click the notification bell if you want to see more videos like this. And until next time, cheers. Cheers.